Hello everyone, I'm the Solar Gamer, and welcome back to Civilization V Brave New World as Gemini. Yes, so last time we met Carthage, and we... What else did we do? We're fighting off barbarians. We lost our only other barbarian friend, but we did gain archers. I think. Yeah, we did. We gained archers from an encampment that was right there. And now what we're going to do is we're going to come down here with these guys. Uh, actually, the... See, this is something I didn't know. Apparently, if you destroy the unit that's in the encampment and you claim it, you don't actually get the unit. So we need to always use a melee unit to break encampments. Which is something I, I didn't know, but it kind of makes sense now that I think about it. So, we're going to have him come down here and heal up. And then we're gonna, all going to go in. We'll weaken the unit that's in there, of course, but we won't kill it. So that, that's good to know now. Thank you. See, I, I learn something new every single time I play this. And it's all thanks to you guys. It really is. You guys are helping me out. I love it. Okay, so we do have some iron up here that we're working on. Did I... Am I building a worker? No. Well, I need to be. Alright, let's get a worker. Seven turns for a worker, that's not bad. And I think what we're gonna do after that is work on a water mill to boost some production up. Yes, yes, yes. We have the Great Library. Yes, we got that last uh, episode as well. That's fantastic. That pushed us into... What was it? Drama and poetry? No, philosophy. I don't think I'm gonna spend the time on the Oracle. If it's already built, that's fine, but... Yeah, no, I don't think I'm gonna do that. Unless I get a great engineer. But I can't because I'm not working any buildings like that, so... Actually, once we get the water mill, I think we'll be able to. Because this should provide... Hang on. Water mill. Um... Actually, it might not. I think it's the workshop that provides something. Yeah. Either way, we're still gonna work in the water mill. Still gonna work... Ugh. Still gonna work on the water mill. Please. Thank you. Alright, and what are we doing over here? Right, we were defending this area from barbarians, so let's see if there's any around here. Oh, more mountains. Not bad. Alright, go and grab those horses again. Oh, we have some hand axemen, but you know what, we'll uh, ignore them for now. Actually, we can send you guys over there. And then once these guys are healed up... Oh, there goes the great lighthouse over... Oh no, she didn't get to build it! Wow. Alright. That's awesome. At least she doesn't have it. That's all I care about. She did build Stonehenge down here, but that's about it, I think. Yeah. I know a lot of people are telling me to look at the, uh, the diplomacy screen to check how many other civs are in the game. And yes, that is a thing that you could do. You could check out the make peace with or declare war on. But you know what? That's cheating. <laughs> that's cheating. And to, to be honest, I think it's actually a bug. I don't think you're supposed to see that. That would make sense, right? You're not supposed to see any other civ because they haven't met it yet. Um, so, that's definitely a bug, and I think Firaxis needs to fix that. How you can just go into the Lumis screen and see every single Civ in City State, it's, it's not really fair. And plus, I like the excitement of discovering things on my own. So I will not be looking at that, I'll just come across them, and we'll see what other Civs there are based on that. Based on luck. Adios, amigo. Now, one thing that I do tend to always get is repeats. Repeat civs, repeat offenders that always like to show up in my games. England being one of them, yes. But I, I really don't play with some some people, ever. And it, that's also a thing that I wanted to kind of address here, is that it feels like most of the time I don't get to play with new people. It's all recycled people from old, you know, playthroughs. So th I think that's that's something that needs to be addressed with Phyrexis as well. Um, because I, I, maybe it's just me. I don't know, but I always seem to never be able to play with other people, like, with new civs. It's usually the same old, same old. I mean, we'll see what happens in this playthrough, see how many civs we have and see what are new or not. But, to be honest, I don't, I don't know. Oh, look at this. Alright, let's go. We don't even need to weaken them, so just stay here, act as a defense for this guy. And hopefully we'll grab him and the worker. In fact, I don't want to give it to Geneva. We could just use it for ourselves. So... Actually, we can use another worker, so we'll just build this one and keep this one. Sounds good. Okay, there's some more sugar. God damn, there's so much sugar. That's not bad. I mean, we could uh, sell it. That's always good. So I think the next place we're going to be uh, settling is probably someplace over here near the ivory. Again, that does seem very, very far away, so I'm hoping that there's something down here with ivory or a new resource. Um, or up here. I, I don't know. It just seems like everything's spaced out so far away. Alright, you're good. Come on down this way. Horses. Four horses. Some cows that we cannot work by the city. Nope. One, two... Oh, no, we can. Yeah, we can. 
One, two, three. That's awesome. Alright, that was stupid of you to come back because now you're dead. Oh, what the hell? It said it was gonna... Uh, uh, fine. Alright, why don't you go there? Okay, yeah. Are this still ruins? What? I think Carthage and I are the only people on this continent. That's pretty frightening, actually. A lot of people are kind of mad that I did the uh, the huge map because of the less interaction between us all eight players. But, I mean, yeah, I technically should have done a large. And I do apologize for that. That was my, my, uh, my bad. But one thing that we can take advantage of now that this has happened is the airports. In Civilization 4, they had airports. And what you could do with them is airlift units from city to city if it had an airport. So they've added that back in to Brave New World so that if we build an airport in Berlin and build an airport in a city that's on another continent, we could easily airlift our units over to that other continent. So late game warfare has become, you know, rather than 30 turns, it's now 10 turns to, you know, prepare an invasion or get it ready or, you know, reinforce. It's, it's much, much easier. So the only thing that we need to do is launch an invasion on one city on that continent and then we'd be golden. I mean, that, that's basically it. And with the whole domination thing, not having any other victory on, um, that also applies to late game as well. We In Brazil, we didn't get past nuclear warfare. We didn't get, we I think we were building the Manhattan Project by the end of the game, so we never even got that far. And I definitely want to do some late game warfare because it seems like we haven't done that yet. So taking off time and taking off science and uh, we got all the other ones, they're just gonna allow us to do a lot of later game warfare, so nuclear death robots. I mean, we did have... Do we have that? In Rome? I think we might have had nuclear death robots in Rome. I'm not sure. I can't remember. All right, yep. Take out them and go in. Come on, give me an Axeman. And a worker, of course. Yes! I will take it. Oh my god. Awesome. Yep. So, from now on, we're always going to melee it. Now, this is an archery, and it upgrades into a knight? Are you kidding me? That's fine. I mean, I like... I like having knights, but... <laughs> what? Uh, okay. Okay, so we'll bring this worker back with the, uh, the warrior. And, uh, we'll kill the remaining barbarians here with the hand axe for experience and the composite bowman. And then we're going to go and grab this, uh, this ruin, as well as this one, because, uh, apparently we just don't have it because apparently nobody's grabbed it yet. So one thing I do want to do, actually, speaking of stuff like that, is grab a scout. I mean, we have our scout now, but now that it's an archer, we should probably just defend with it. Uh, but we do need to scout out this area and stuff like that, so I guess getting another scout would be beneficial to us. All right, next turn. See what these guys do. Oh, really? You would attack over water. That's the stupidest thing. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. Ah. Oh. Oh, I was going to say, you upgraded? Okay, yes, you did. And this horseman over there. Get rough terrain and wipe him out. Or two of them. That works. Okay, you're good. Why don't you work on... I guess production. Go over there. Build me a lumber mill. And you can head down this way. The worker's going to go back to the city. Well, actually, the worker can just go straight to Hamburg. You can head back this way as well. Yeah, I guess that's fine. There we go. Good. Yes. All right. So what do we do? Just bribe them? That's what I think it is. I mean, that... Oh. He who commands the sea has command of everything. I wasn't even going to prioritize uh, sailing because, well, we only have one sailing city or one city connected to the ocean. So that's really nice. Getting that out of the way. All right, there's more iron over here too, though. Mm. There's really nothing over here. There's bananas, but bananas, you know. Better is bread with a happy heart than wealth with vexation. Awesome. We have currency. And here's our third worker. We're going to have him build a road to Hamburg. Get that all hooked up. Well, this guy's just going to go straight to... Sugar? No, go straight to the iron. That's more important. Okay, and... 
you can... Hang on, what do we have for tech right now? We have horseback riding. Chivalry's way, way down there, so we're not going to be upgrading this guy for a long while. Uh, but I do want to keep him protected because he's not that strong. Well, actually, he is pretty strong. Yeah, nine. He's actually stronger than the freaking warrior. Okay, well, the warrior's going to go back to Berlin. Because when I get the iron, I want to upgrade him immediately. And this guy, I guess, can heal right here. You can build that lumber mill. And you can be on guard duty. Yeah, why don't you, um, sit on top of that hill? Okay, where are we going? We just discovered sailing and currency. Uh, one was from the Barbarian encampment. I think we should go and get iron working. That's going to be eight turns. You're going to get there in seven turns. So actually, we could probably grab something else beforehand if we wanted to. We can grab optics. Yeah, you know what? Grab optics first and then go to iron working. That's fine. We're at 174 out of 200 to get a... Oh my... Oh, we just got a ruined! That gave us 60 faith! Oh my god, that's going to help us out so much. We built the temple, right? Yeah, we built a temple, so... Oh, that's so good. That is... Oh, oh. I like this. This is like a nice channel right here. So if there's a civilization over here, they're just going to have a hard time coming through here. We could easily defend this. I like that. And probably the same thing up here. Not bad. I mean, for natural defense, this area over here is perfect. Hamburg is in a great location. Surrounded by this channel, that channel, and this one. I mean, ugh, easy. Easy defense. Look at that. It just got shorter. This is looking lovely. And then with this archer, we're going to go and scout some more because this is our scout archer, yes? Yes. Okay. So once you're done healing, we'll have you scout some more. Keep going. Yeah, look at that. Ruins. And this is our regular composite bowman. Um, I guess we can use it as scout too. I mean, this is all planes and stuff, so it's going to be easy traveling. Yeah, go ahead. All right, we're going to have this hand axe stand on that hill rather than this one. We don't really want to bunker bust. Um, these uh, encampments, so if we can reduce our impact on fog busting, then I want to do so. Plus, I want to protect these uh, workers up here, so we'll just move it like that. Alright, so we have another freaking ruin to go into. That's awesome. That is really nice. It's a nice little desert over here. Alright, let's uh, grab it. Ah, oh, that sucks. I hate maps. I really do. Okay, well, it's not the end of the world, I suppose. There's some pearls. That's way, way, way out of our reach. I'll only come up here later on once we have this area. Scout this area, because I want to see what's over there. Alright, you can head down. And across. More bananas. Eh. Okay, so let's see. We could either adopt the rest of tradition, which would give us 15% growth and a free aqueduct in my first four cities. It'll also allow purchasing of great engineers of faith, starting in the industrial era. That's good. That's very nice. Um, we could also get an honor to tell us where all the barbarians are. You know what? I think we're going to grab that next. Oh, and we gain culture. Yes. Okay. For each barbarian kills. Wait, is it barbarian? Yeah. Barbarian kills. Okay. Awesome. There's one right there. All right. Let's hold off and head towards that with you. Actually, you're going to heal here first. Then we're going to head up there. In fact, you're going to come back around. You made an instrument to know if the moon shine at full or no. Great, we have optics, so we can build the lighthouse and we can embark. Uh, did I not set the scout to come before the... No, I did not. Great. Okay, I meant to. But, I guess it doesn't matter now. Alright, sit there for now until this guy is fully healed. Keep going. Look at that. Awesome. Uh, 20 culture. Good work. Head down this way. Oh, look at that iron. Damn. Oh, that's such a good... If if Berlin spawned right there, I would push this way. This is so good. Just all of this stuff clustered in this area is awesome. And over here, it's like crap. All right, there's a barbarian. Head there. You can head this way and defend. Basically. Alright, just head on then. Laventa was bullied by Carthage recently, and they look 
and they are looking for some way to bring this injustice to their attention to the major world powers. If you denounce Carthage, they will be very grateful. Well, you're Leventa. And I don't really care about you, I care about Geneva, so... Not gonna start a war this early over a city-state. Oh! More ruins! God! That's awesome! That is so good. Alright, I think what we're gonna do is send the second scout up this way and have this uh, the spearman come back because I mean he's far away from home now. Yeah, let's let's start heading back. Haha. -ha. All right. And you can go grab that. Oh, look at. What? Okay, we gained population, but that's right next to a Carthage city. Are you kidding me? Oh, that's great. Oh my Jesus. Um, okay, you're done with that, so why don't you get the hell out of here? Oh, you're not even finished yet with this. I was wondering why it was only plus one production. Yeah, it should be two. Okay, well, we'll finish that now. My god, do we need to work on these guys? Uh, right. Kill. Alright, oh, kill. Uh, go there. Terracotta army has been built in a faraway land. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So that military of the person just got increased tenfold, huh? Oh, Carthage is first in soldiers. Well, we know what they're planning right now. They're planning on coming to me. Great. Okay, we need a horseman then. And not an axeman disguised as a horse. <laughs> Alright, ten turns to construct that mine. That's actually a long time, but, you know, that's fine. We'll get that swordsman as soon as possible. There we go, we gain some culture. How much? How much culture? Eight! Okay, that was beneficial. We should have done that earlier. Attack him. You can attack him, and then move up. Oh my goodness. Yeah, they're starting to come around, aren't they? Damn it, Carthage! Why do you have to ruin a good thing? You have one side, I have the other. Let's just leave it at that, huh? Jesus Christ. Alright. Berlin, let me have you build a catapult and two more warriors. And then build, uh, obviously, a market and a mint to get our economy back up because it is falling now, but that's all right. I don't care. We have plenty of money to spare. We have to bring this spearman down here now. There's no exceptions. All right, you're done, so go there. Statue of Colossus has been built in a faraway land. Wasn't Carthage. Religion founded. Islam. No! Get your religion off of this continent now. Because I will not tolerate this crap. Alright. Head back down to Hamburg now. Go. And you can finish that. Goods. We have a scout. You're going to head up this way. And then I'll have you auto explore once you get up here. And you could go right there and attack him. Attack him. Hopefully begin a horseman here. About 12 culture, and oh my god, yes. That's so nice. That is awesome. <laughs> oh my god, this is great. Plus, we're getting culture crazily now by killing all these uh, these barbarians. That's so nice. Alright, well, what we're going to do is bring the scout, basically draw a line this way and see if there's uh, an army approaching us. Because I know there probably is. Okay, now... We'll send this guy back here, because as soon as we can, we're going to upgrade him. Why don't you... Uh, yeah, I guess take the uh, the production boost to the shrine. That's fine. Even though we don't really need it right now. Because we're going to get a great profit in basically a turn or whenever it spawns. After a turn. Hopefully it spawns next turn, but it usually doesn't. It's just a chance that it will spawn after you get 200. So technically we can go up to 400 and not get one. Um, but... We'll see. Hopefully we get it soon. Alright. Go that way. Go that way. There's some marble down here. But it's not in our reach. So, it's not really helpful. Alright, head back. You're gonna head back too. As well as you. Until we find the next barbarian encampment. And head that way. Alright. Still nothing. But they would try to make a direct line this way. So, we'll see if there's anything in there. There's some wine up here. So, 
Hmm. Heading up this way might not actually be a bad idea. So we could basically hug the river and then soon we'll get to the wine and the ivory. Actually, that's probably a better way to do it. Build a city up here first, and then over here, and then we'll come down here. Nice big empire. It all depends on where Carthage goes, basically. Uh, yeah, stop for a second, go up there, grab that, then come back. I told you to keep going. What are you doing? Just don't stop. Alright, go grab that. Oh, more barbarians. Hmm. Oh, look at that. We're not going to take care of that for them. No, they could suffer. Okay, horseman's there. Why don't you sit... I guess right there. And you are going to sit right there. And you're going to the city. Okay, Hamburg, you built your shrine? Really? Oh, that, that helped it immensely, I guess. Jesus, okay. Um, build me a water mill. We need to gain your production up fast. All right, seven turns for that mine. They'll be able to build, or work on, rather, our uh, swordsmen. In fact, is it easier to build warriors and then... You know, we'll just build swordsmen. Why don't you work on the market beforehand? Do not wait to strike till the iron is hot. But make it hot by striking. Awesome, we have iron working and a great profit. Awesome. That's so good. Alright, I don't see any warriors here. Or warriors. Warriors. Uh, an army coming towards us. But... It is still making me a little bit nervous that they have the highest soldier count. And I don't see a damn a damn thing. It might, you know what, it might just be boats. Because we saw two Queen Kareems, which is their unique unit down there. It replaces the Trireme, I believe. Or the Gallius. Um... So, I don't know. We'll see. Alright, let's definitely found our religion. How many more are there to go, basically? Uh, blah, 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 blah. World of Religions? Three. Okay, so... Oh, Hinduism was founded. Yeah, let's go found a monument. <laughs> no. Build me a religion. <laughs> Head to this little hill. Yeah, I, I don't think they're coming towards us yet. It might just be all boats, which is a strong force, especially on a 11 defense city. Um, so we might want to build something like that soon. Alright, let's see. Great person already built it. Alright, what are we going to grab? Hmm. I don't want Doomsday anymore. Doomsday is done. Let's... let's what was that? Something just fell. Let's still grab the same symbol for Sikhism. I like that symbol. Uh, and I guess we'll do Soulism? This was suggested by somebody else. I'm, I'm not sure. Salarianism? <laughs> sure, we'll get Salarianism. That's fine. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Goddess of Love, yes. Uh, what else? Do, 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 do. We can get Tith. Oh my god, this is really bad. Okay, plus one global happiness for every two cities following this religion. That's good, I suppose. Initiation rights. I hate this one. This is so stupid. Papal primacy. Plus 15 to influence resting point with city-states. That's also good. Um, but that's for more diplomatic reasons. Peace-loving. Plus one global happiness for every eight flow... For eight followers of this religion in non-enemy foreign cities. Okay, let's just get Tith. Plus one gold for every four followers of this religion. That really adds up. And I forgot to get that during our Brazil... Was it Brazil? No, it was our, our last German series, actually. Huh, alright. Now for this. What am I gonna get now? Okay. Use faith to purchase. Eh. I really like just getting religious community because it's plus 1% production for each follower and the max is 15 in every city. So we'd get 15% production in every city if we once we get 15 followers. Or is that in a city? I guess it's for every... Ah, I don't know, actually. That's, that's good to know. So maybe it's in each city they have their own multiplier. Either way, the more people that are following this religion in its own city makes it uh, have more production. And I like that. Especially considering this is really going to help us with our, basically, our economy and, and well, I guess production now. So, let's do that. Yeah. Religious community. And I like, the one thing that I do like is the enhancer belief. So, right when we get our next great profit, we're enhancing this. And hopefully we can get, like, religious spread or, what is it called? I don't even know. Either way, let's have found this. Good. We have Solarianism in the city of Berlin. Awesome. All right, let's grab guilds, maybe? I don't know, what are we gonna grab? Actually, yeah, let's go to guilds, enter the medieval era. 
or we could go up to civil service, which would, which would not really help us here. Um, what should we grab? Allows establishing an additional trade route, which we, do we have a trade route? Yep. I don't think so. Let's go to engineering then and start working on our trade. And I still don't see an army over here, which is, I guess, a good sign. Ugh, really? A map? Did we really just find a map? Oh yeah, yeah. All right. Well, explore up north, please, and you're gonna have to come back down here. Probably fight your way out, which I suppose is fine. I'm surprised that ugh, this makes me mad. I really wish I did just a large map. Why would you attack me? Oh my god, you're so stupid. <laughs> yeah, go there. Give me some more culture. I don't know how much I gained there. Uh, do, 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 do. All I'm seeing is workers. Yeah, like there's no... What the hell? How did they get a great general? They don't have any battles. What the hell's going on? How many cities do you have? Dumb. The Berta? One, two, three, four cities. And I can only see three of them. Unless we, there's some more in there, but no, I can see like... I can see the end of her border this way, so this is probably a coastline. What the hell? What is going on over here? Alright, we have catapults. Why don't you sit on the gold? Because basically all we're going to defend from is those boats. Uh, right now, so just go over there. That's fine. Repairing encampment discovered. Okay, looks like we're moving out as soon as we can. Actually, you know what? We're going to wait until we grab uh, swordsmen here, and then we'll head out. We can start bringing you up, though. And you, I suppose. And we're going to bring this guy back home to defend Berlin. And then this guy can continue to scout. I don't know. But you're probably going to die if you don't get out of there. So get out of there. Don't go there. I swear to God, don't go there. Geneva Tar... Damn it, Geneva. Why do you target this one? God damn it. Uh, You know what? We should probably just go over there and clear that out. Oh, there's a worker. I mean, a uh, uh, swordsman. Alright, why don't you come down here and sit, and we'll bring this guy down here. I really don't want to, but if Geneva wants it, then Geneva shall have it. Okay. Alright, you're gonna head back home. Hamburg demands copper. Right, okay. Let me just get right on that. Oh, wait a minute. What the hell is copper? <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, you still want truffles? You want copper? I'm glad our citizens know what the hell they're talking about. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. All right, kill him. In fact, we could probably take on these guys. Um, yeah, we could probably take them on. Well, we need to heal first now, but we could probably... Wipe them out, maybe gain a unit. That'd be fantastic. Statue of Zeus has been built in a faraway land. Okay. Oh, hello there. How are you? Go, 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 go. Sit tight. Heal up. Do whatever. Move to Hamburg. Come on. Don't dilly-dally. We need to connect this trade up because we're losing 16! 16 because of this goddamn road. And here's the first boat. It has arrived. You know what, let's move the catapult over here. What the hell? What just happens? No, what, what just broke? Oh. No, wait, what? I don't know what's going on. I have no idea. Oh wow, look at that. Never mind, just kill them. 
We didn't lose a single unit! I have never seen that. That is amazing. Oh my god, that was awesome. <laughs> oh, damn. Alright, come on down. You know what? Let's clear out this uh, this horseman so the, uh, the spearman goes in there. That way there we get the spearman instead. I think that'll be worthwhile. And now go grab the sugar. Thank you very much. Oh, the boats are moving on. Where are they going? Okay, well, we'll leave the catapult there for now. All right, plantation, build it. Oh, he destroyed a unit. But we have, that's <laughs> so good. Oh, uh, that's great. All right, keep hurting this guy. All right, now we're gonna sit there and wait till that spearman goes into the city. I know it sounds pretty ridiculous, but it'll work because with a defenseless city, unless they spawn a new unit, they're gonna bring their other unit back or their closest. So let's hope it's that spearman. We just gained 12, yeah, 12 um, culture. Awesome. We are really gaining the culture now. Come on back. Really? Well, I'm not gonna take it with nothing in it. So, you're, you're shit out of luck, sir. I'll wait till something gets inside of it. I'm just farm off culture right now. <laughs> uh, rough terrain, that's fine. Yep. I wanted you to heal up, please. You could heal up as well. Good. And let's see here. Spearman against horses. That's a good match. All right, one thing I do want to set up is um, a settler. We'll set that up after the caravan, or before the caravan, actually. Hinduism has been enhanced. And Dido entered the medieval era. That's fine. Yeah, we're not that far away. Instrumental or mechanical science is the noblest, and above all the others, the most useful. Great. Okay, and... Move up. Move up. Heal. Um, heal. Keep attacking. Oh my god, that was great. Okay, yeah, just sit tight here for now. Actually, the one thing I don't want happening is Carthage coming up here and taking it. Um, so we will just have my warrior over here. <laughs> just to make sure that doesn't happen. Alright, what are we getting now? I think we should work on a workshop. Or rather, metal casting, so we can get a workshop, so we can start work on great engineers. Yes, because that's the only way I'm going to build wonders, so might as well, you know, have something in the back burner working on that. Sure, yes. Alright, also, I'm going to cancel the, the warrior right there and build a swordsman. In fact, I should just cancel that one too, even though it's already on... Well... Nah, I guess we'll keep it. But I do want swordsman instead. And a settler, so we'll put the settler in front of the caravan. The mint is fine. Okay. Oh, we're finally gonna grab that iron down there. Good. Uh, yeah, work on him. You work on him. Oh, wow. You're a little, uh, bit defended there. Okay. 